once upon a time, there was this young, skillful, handsome boy, you know, just made character stuff, named Malin Kundang, who lived with her mother. Well, his father, I have no idea. He's not in the story, okay? This skillful young boy had fed up with poor life that he's living in because he and his mother were just fisherman's helper and decided to f*** off, sailing to another island. Well, his mother is not a fan of that, but to be honest, I think his mother thought the same, right? Like, enough is enough for this Humpty Dumpty poverty lifestyle that they live in. The very next day, Malin Kundang sets off to a new quest. He asked by an NPC in the ship whether he wants to join the crew or not, but with only yes choice in the text box, he of course immediately accepted. His mother hugged and told him to take care of himself while filling his inventory with food and supplies. A nod and a sad face given by him as a response. What a good boy. Well, it's suddenly a year later. Malin Kundang's mother hadn't hearing anything from his son. Maybe he's just AFK or dead, who knows. After a day and night of praying and praying for his son, and by the way, she is religious, and nothing from his son, so sad. Her hope is slowly fading and her money is rapidly decreasing. But this poor woman is still waiting for our main character to come back home. Maybe bring some money with him. And hey, it's a time jump again and we suddenly jumped several years later. One day, a ship pulled over just in time for our sad, sad mother, which is still there waiting for her son to come and say hi, long time no see, and blah blah blah. Well, to her surprise, there's a skillful but older, handsome man stepping down from the ship's ladder and a beautiful young woman after him. Who is this man? A new main character? Oh wait, he is Malin, and his mother easily recognizes him. The poor woman rushed to him and welcomed his son. His son, maybe? Saying stuff like, Malin, you're back! Just to be responded with a cold shoulder. Oh wait, a cool cold shoulder. The man with an anime stare saying that he doesn't know who this poor woman is. Malin's mother then remind him that she is her mother, like, of course. Then Malin turned his body around anime style while calling his bodyguards to keep this poor woman away from him. We are finally on the final arc of this story. Sad, sad, sad. In the same day, Malin's mother prayed to God if the man is truly the main character of the story. She cursed him to become a f in stone, yeah, a stone, not even gold, so she can, you know, sell it, but whatever. Well, not long after that, our main character, far, far away from her mother on the another island, BAM, suddenly turned into a stone. The end.